Hey everybody, it's Timo here. Before the video starts, I want to remind you only 3.7% of people who are watching my channel have subscribed and the rest didn't. I post videos every single day, I post Rogue and I post Barb, that's the type of the content I like to make. And anyway, if you like to play on any of those classes, I highly encourage you to press subscribe button as it's both gonna help you and me in the long run. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Alright, so... In the previous video that we made, we built the blue variant. In today's video, we're gonna build the uh, ruby silver red variant. I think it's a pretty cool idea. I haven't really played with this ruby silver gear, so how about we buy something and we're gonna go and test that out. I'm gonna buy this little helmet with a bit of agility because uh, I don't want to be slowing down too much. The Ruby Silver already offers you a lot of dexterity, which is pretty sick. There's one thing that I didn't know is that you could actually use the doublet on a barb. I didn't know that, and I think it's pretty cool. So yeah, that's actually gonna be new. That's actually gonna be my first time, the very first time of using the Ruby Silver doublet. Because, uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna buy this piece with 3 agility. It uh, seems like a quite cost effective. Let's just buy it. Since there is no really red pants that you could find, let's just aim for the Brave Hunter pants. They offer a sick black color, and that's pretty much what we we'll should be able to suit the drip we're gonna play with. Pretty well. Here we go, we got a little piece that's iron bed at all. Okay, let's look for the gloves. Hopefully we get something cool for more or less decent price. The price is actually quite expensive for the stats it offers. Whatever, it's not that deep, you know what I mean? It's absolutely not big of a deal. Alright, so we have the main core of the belt. We have the rubber silver that we need. So, now we actually gotta look for some rings that we actually... Oh, I think this one is gonna be good. One old, a little bit of armor, a little bit of true. Pretty much it has everything that we do need, you know what I mean? Alright, as for now, I think this ring will do. A little bit of... Oh, we got some action. Hell yeah, man. Alright, let's look for the adventure cloak with action speed. Damn, the price went up. A thousand gold for this cloak? Bro, they used to be 300, bro. It's okay, though. Yeah, the price may have went up a little bit. It's not that big of a deal. Just gotta find a source of gold to replicate of it all. The amount of stuff that I have for sale is ridiculous. I probably have like another 100k in my inventory just in rings alone all right so since we don't want to go past the 300 point we just gonna keep a little bit of pots and we're gonna hop in right away all right we're finally in okay let's go all the way down to the south and see if we get a spawn there <laughs> Oh wow, holy fuck. I was actually such a clean shot. God damn. Uh. Oh, freaking mobs. I'm not sure what is the matter with this guy though. But yeah, the way he died was kind of silly though. I may actually use his rings to buff my move speed. Now that I think of it, it's probably not a bad idea, you know what I mean? It's very good. With art. I'm kind of slow though. Mmm. Pushing him through the traps could be a really bad idea. So let's take the look. There's really not that many places where he could go from that point though. <laughs> the panic button activated. It's my turn now. Ow. 
Did you put that? Mm hmm. Huh. The walk flame stuff. Oh, that actually kind of hurts. Gotta be careful. Well, almost worked out. Did you, brother? Interesting. He has some magic. I think I'm all alone here. Let's see if I'm right. Are you fucking kidding me? Brother, I looted the fucking gold pile a little more than 2000 times and I didn't get a single gold chest during the whole freaking wipe. This game must be absolutely freaking trolling me. <laughs> it's okay though. Looks like we have more than one player here. I wonder if they're teaming. Yeah, they're right here. They're just over here. I think they are. <laughs> it's okay though. We're gonna take your kit. You better get lost. Hell no! Oh fuck, you actually may be right. Hey, sure, sure, sure. Listen, man, I'll get lost. Oh shit, we have a bug here. Have to be very careful. Can't afford to miss. One miss is gonna be GG. Fuck. Alright, it's okay. We're just gonna reset a little bit. Oh, that's mine now. Oh, that's mine too. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's mad. A little mad. Maybe he isn't mad at all, but I just uh, figured that people really like to call everyone mad no matter fucking what. Even when they're clearly not. Oh, look at him. Look at this guy. One more shot. Shit. I missed. It's okay. Did you, brother? It was a very close fight. I don't think he was full HP though. I don't think he was healing himself in the process. Wow, his gear is actually pretty damn good. Actual Giga Chat. The straw hat. Ooh, one old goddamn. All right, all right, listen, listen. Here, you got an actual chance. Listen, listen. Hey, stop, stop, stop. I'm gonna give you a chance. You gotta guess head or tails, brother. Hello? Uh, trust me, trust me. I'm not gonna hit you. Guess heads or tails, brother. I'm right behind you. Bro, 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 bro. bro. I'm right behind you, man. Fuck. Okay, well, you're not getting fucking away, man. Bro. Wee. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. Calm down, calm down. Listen. No need to be offensive. Oh shit, there is a teaming rogue right behind him. I got you, I got you, they're teaming with her. I'm with you, I'm with you. We gotta get him. I'm with you, I'm with you. Let's go. Let's go, let's go with her. We gotta fuck them up. Let's go, let's go. You can do it. I'll get the I'll get this piece of shit, cleric. Good shit, good shit. Let's go kill the other guy as well. Yo, you can have his stuff if you want to. This rogue ain't getting away, man. I'm not gonna let him get away. You can team up all you want, but there is consequences. <laughs> oh, fuck. I need these goblins. You did, you did. <laughs> you absolutely did, brother. Did you? Good piece, by the way. Armor, all. Actual cheese, actual cheese. Good stiletto, 600 gold right there. Good game.
Oh, this wizard is still here. Atta boy, atta boy. Good stuff, I'm happy this guy survived. Oh, he's a demigod though as well. Oh shit, this boy is cooking, man, this boy is cooking. Oh, what do we have here? <laughs> oh fuck, bitch. Calm down, calm down. No need to be offensive. He's actually freaking fast. How are you here? <laughs> How is so fast in the fucking what? What is the name of the armor? The full tunic or something? Yeah, the man is fast. God damn. All right, all right. Listen, listen. Next time he's gonna open door, I'm gonna smack his arm. <laughs> Wait, he's still alive? Are you freaking kidding me? Wow, I hope he was big time dead. I think he is already. Holy cow, man. I'm gonna be honest. I literally stopped attacking him because I thought he was already dead. I thought it was a corpse dropping behind me. <laughs> but he wasn't. He was as healthy as it could get, you know what I mean? That is so weird. And it's actually so rare because uh, I can calculate the damage I do pretty well based on my experience, but wasn't the case this time, man. Holy cow. <laughs> Ooh, we have another barb. Barb on barb action. Let's freaking go. Oh yeah, that was that was pretty quick though. <laughs> Good fight, brother. Look at that wire, brother. That's actually so good. Do I look better with the um, red cape? No, I don't think I do. Alright, I guess time to go to aesthetic. Oh, shit, there's something here. Alright, let's use the savage. Wow, bro. Holy tank, man. The guy was not dying absolutely freaking lootly. Jesus. That was a good fight, though. GG, brother. Bro, the fight we had it was just so freaking weird, man. <laughs> it was actually fucking hilarious. Oh, look at him. He, he ain't got shit, bro. <laughs> well, it was, uh, it was a pretty sick fight. It's been a minute since the last time when I literally had to fucking rotate 180 degree after each and every hit I make. Alright, I just made another quick rotation around the map and I wasn't able to find absolutely freaking nothing. So let's just go to the static and let's go into the next game A sub. Looks like we have someone here. There's so many geared warlocks in the lobby. Hopefully we'd come across them. It's time to exterminate evil warlocks. Why oh, yeah, that's not a warlock. Wow. <laughs> GG, brother. Good fight. See what he has. Some cheese. A lot of Francescas. Some nets. We definitely need those. Hell yeah, man. I don't want to get cornered, so we gotta heal up while being outside. Because if someone decides to come in, I don't want to be inside this little tiny hole. Because I'm gonna be trapped. Yeah, he has some cheese. There's gotta be someone in here, man. There's gotta be somebody. Okay, I don't want to go through here. Break this place. Bro, there's so many warlocks and I can't find a single one of them. Where did they go? Did they just like fight each other at the start and just fucking went to static or something? I don't even know. We have a player here. Okay. Alright, let's see what his plan is. That's a fighter. Oh no, that was a big mistake, brother. Oh well, I guess there's not gonna be any fucking warlocks in this lobby. Oh well. Probably gonna find some more in the next one. But that's so weird though. There's so many of them in the lobby and they just fucking disappeared. That's kind of cringe. This is it. 
the time has come. We got fucking more warlocks, bro. I wasn't able to find them last time, but I'm most definitely gonna find them this game. Hell yeah, this boy is chunky. Oh, I'm not gonna let him get away, man. Nope. This guy doesn't know, but he's already dead and his loot belongs to me now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hopefully we get more warlocks. One isn't enough. Hell yeah, brother! We got another warlock. Oh, holy fuck, that's actually so much cheese. God damn. Damn, bro. Boy, is actual cheesy. Yeah, we gotta fuck him up, we gotta take his stuff. This guy gear set is maybe 20k plus. I feel like that chest piece alone that he had is probably like 10 to 15k or more. Three perfect warlock stats. Bunch of true. Yeah, I think maybe like 30k kit that what he has, but uh, that could be a little um, overestimate. So, anyway, let me know how much you guys think this Warlock kit is going to go for in the current day and age and the price. As for now, we're going to go and try to find them. Guys, guys, pro strat, don't use pots, go and use the heal shrine. And if there is a rock behind this wall, I'm gonna be absolutely obliterated because I'm fucking too greedy to use my pots. But not necessarily greedy, you know, sometimes greed is good. So yeah, if there would be a player spawn right here, I would be absolutely fucked up, but that's okay. I'm gonna use the heal shrine and now I'm all good. Because when it comes to fighting the warlocks, I would most definitely freaking need all the pots that I actually have. And yeah, if you are bringing a really good gear, you know, don't mind using, you know, open up box. Oh shit, we actually have something here. We gotta figure out who that is. Oh, that's the rope. That's the warlock. That's the warlock. That's him. That's him. That's the guy. Okay, that's the first victim of today's video. Oh wait, that's actually not my first game. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. Right. Step number one: make him chase you. Step number two: fuck him up. Well, we haven't got to step number two yet, but we're gonna get there eventually. So we gotta figure out the path that we wanna take. Okay. Decent enough. Oh, wait a second. Hold on a minute. We have another warlock here. <laughs> That's another victim in my book. Yeah. Alright, brother, you ain't getting away. That's about it. That's about GG. Rest in peace. Oh, hell yeah. My homie, I knew you were chasing me, brother. I could hear you that from a mile away. No, brother, you aren't getting away either. You can count down before you're gonna die. It's gonna be the matter of time. Because I'm right on your ass. Turn around, use your course, and you will die. So that just GG. Rest in peace, brother. Oh god, bro. That was actually so freaking silly. <laughs> okay, let's see what they have. Alright. Bunch of chi. Oh god. The true magic damage doesn't really go for that much, but uh, it's still pretty decent. But I'm not really uh, for this guy here. I'm for that guy with a bunch of true. So we just gotta get their ace up. I don't think there's really any rogues in the lobby, so... Actually, there was one. Fuck. Gotta hurry my ass up. Alright, let's see what this champ has. Okay. What the freak? I'm stuck, man. Oh. Fucking lantern. <laughs> okay. Oh. Bro. That's upgrades right there. Straight up. Might as well replace. This. Oh, boy. That's actually so freaking good. That's actually so good. Yeah, this boy is cheese. The guy is actual champ, brought in actual gear. My homie. Oh, look at it. Oh, God, bro. Hell yeah. Yo, this piece is like 15 grand, I think. A little more, a little less. Gotta figure that out. I'm being kind of paranoid about that rogue, though. Oh, wait a second. Actually... Nobody can sneak up on you anymore unless it's a rogue with the creep, right? I don't think there was a single rogue in the lobby with the creep, so yeah, I should be definitely fine. I probably shouldn't even give two fucks about, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's like only rogues with a sneak would sneak up on you. Like, how many rogues there is gonna be in the lobby with the sneak, with the creep? 
probably like none because well i haven't seen any i've seen rogue and that rogue didn't have a creep so i think i'm absolutely fine i'm just being paranoid for absolutely freaking nothing <sighs> man this guy has a little too much cheese holy cow and I kind of want to keep all of it, you know, I got to make as much profit because the vibe comes in five days and for five days I still got to make videos and uh, to make videos. Yo, 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 this hitter shield is five grand at least, man. Actually, at least five grand. I'm not capping. That's like the max roll for the blue. Max blue roll shield actually goes always for a lot. I also want to take those boots. I think those boots are another thousand. Yeah, that's just at least a thousand. Okay, yeah. I think, fuck it. Let's get out of here. Open the door. Let me in. Let me in, brother. Alright, might as well take a chill pill. Haha, <laughs> it's okay. Yo, are you freaking kidding me, bro? The moment I took a sit, you opened the gate. Bro, you're, you're freaking trolling me, man. I'm 100% I'm positive the game's trolling me. Wait a second, this guy has a creep. Where the fuck this guy came from? This is not the guy that I saw in the pre-lobby, but oh well. Look at also at his build. That's actually pretty cool. Weak point, blood thrust. He might do some damage to fighters. Not a bad build. We have a player spawn right in front of me. What the frick? How rare that is. That's like... Wow, that's actually so rare. One in a lifetime opportunity, you know what I mean? Freak. And I just missed my Francesco like that. Oh, he popped his second win. Either was hurt or he fucking fat fingered. One of two. Mm, no, not good. Let's back off and let's wait until I get all my um, skills back. You know, I'm cool with it. Gotta kill the mob. He's in my deck. Okay, he's gonna reload. Okay. Even if he headshots me, it's really not that big of a deal. It's Savage War is almost back. Let's just. Uh, Keep him on the edge of my sword. <laughs> or axe. Once we have savage, we're gonna commit in. <coughs> GG, brother. You turn your back when I hit you. That was just a little unlucky. GG, brother. The torch behind him was so freaking evil. Because I died literally the exact same way. I fucking stumbled upon the freaking torch. And that torch was the reason why I ended up dying. It wasn't the only time, it actually, like, I was also was able to trick some really good players into getting, uh, you know, stuck onto some um, obstacles. Like, for example, a walking centipede or torch or, like, edge of the wall. So, yeah, you could actually use it to your advantage. Especially when you're in a pressing class like a barb. Someone was here. Someone used all the elevators. Killed all the mobs, have to be careful here. Don't want to get right out. Oh, here we go, we have a little fighter. Alright. Hmm, he wastes the sprint, let's wait it out. Once it's done. What he can really do. I don't think you can block, um, Pelanax with the round shield. You can block with the heater shield. Oh, you bitch. Ow. Oh no, what am I supposed to do? Help. Nah, it's a joke. <laughs> no, it's, it's really is just a meme. Oh, fucking died too bad. Oh my goodness, bro. That's minus one to my kill stat. GG. Bad is a real winner. <laughs> oh, we have a we have a ranger. It's going in trap zone. Looks like. What are you even supposed to do in a situation like this? <laughs> like, really, like, you're a ranger who is not that fast. If you don't build Muspet with true, with survival, what are you really supposed to do, man? I don't think there is really that much stuff you can. But when you're really geared, oh yeah, the ranger is probably a more oppressive class than any other class. Literally, the ranger will control the fight from start to the end. But, you know, to get to that point, you have to be really geared. So is a rogue, though. But, uh, for the ranger, you don't need to commit as much as you need to commit on the rogue. A rogue is just cringe. And a little sad class, you know what I mean? <laughs> and little weakest class in Dark and Darker. But yeah, that's just rogue, you know what I mean? Now we're playing on the best class, which is Barbarian. 
my currently favorite class. No, don't get me wrong, you can still play on Rogue, you can still do pretty well, but it just like... Nothing feels even relatively close to how good the Barbarian feels after you played on the Rogue long enough, you know what I mean? I play on the Rogue for a little bit, and then I hop on the Barb and I almost feel invincible. And then, like, the only reason why I could die is if I get overly cocky, you know what I mean? Yeah, I, a majority of the time I die because I get cocky and I do stupid shit, you know what I mean? <laughs> but anyway, I think this is it. Alright, I guess let's call it a day. We had actually quite a bunch of fights. If you enjoyed the video, I'd really appreciate if you press subscribe button, because I'm gonna do a lot more barb videos in the future. Anyway, it's Timo, and I hope you have a wonderful day.